Greetings, friends, families, faculty members, and administrators, staff, alumni, and the brave class of 2020. It's an honor to be here speaking to you as a Reading High Senior Class President. Congratulations, seniors. Today is our day. Today we acknowledge all of the hard work, the early morning, the late night studying, and we honor everyone who helped us and pushed us to get where we are here today. Though our journey will never be easy, there are always people in our lives that help us along our path and help us construct the foundation we will continue to build upon. To simply say thank you is an understatement of appreciation and admiration for everyone who, helped, who has helped us and my classmate in one way or another over the last four years. But it is the most straightforward way of showing my gratitude to everyone who has given me support in both my life and my high school career. So I would take this opportunity to say thank you to my class advisors and cl fellow class officers. Thank you to Ms. Marinette Lopez for guiding me and being my school mentor throughout my high school career. I want to take this moment to say, to give a, a big special thank you to my number one fans and biggest supporters for being by my side every step of the way. My mother, my father, Virginia and Cesar Martinez, Mommy, Papi, gracias y lo amo mucho. Before I finish my thank yous, I want to take this moment to highlight a student who has a true representation of a red night. I would like to pay homage to Milo Brown. We, all, we know that you're not here with us wearing your cap and gown, but you made a very big impact in our hearts. I still remember the day in middle school when you took my phone at, the, at our end of the year trip and he took a selfie of everyone behind us. That picture is legendary and I will forever keep it. Last but not least, I want to thank, I want to thank Mr. Terman, the Terminator, for not only being a great principal, but for always going an extra mile to be a role model and to guide me down the correct path. As freshmen, sophomores, juniors, we watched the classes before us have their time and their moment. And man, we knew that we would get that too but no one could ever have predicted how different our moment would be. When school started back in September, we knew that our senior year wouldn't be easy, but none of us were prepared for this. Our last moment of high school came to the fortunate end. We didn't know our last day of school was our last day of school. COVID-19 canceled the spring of our senior year, but COVID-19 cannot take our senior experience away from us. We are red knights and we are strong. Not because of what happened to it, but how we responded to it. This class of 2020 will go down in history as the most persistent, resilient, and courageous class to ever attend Reading High School. Let me remind you something powerful about us red knights. We don't hide in the face of adversity. We don't give up. We definitely don't take no as an answer. After today, we will go out and face the world. And I know that we'll be able to help and make a change happen. We are the future. Our city needs us more than ever before. I am deeply and profoundly honored to be your class president for the past two years. I love you all. Please keep in touch and don't be afraid to chase your dreams because we are not only Red Knights, but we are a strong class of 2020. Once a Red Knight, always a Red Knight.